G'day, I'm Charlie Pride. And I'm Jennifer Pride. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Pride of the Villages. Look into the month of February. We will highlight some festivals occurring both inside and outside the villages. Starting in the villages, we have two major festivals. First is Mardi Gras at Lake Sumter Landing on Tuesday, the 13th of February from 4 to 9 p.m. There will be many food and merchandise vendors participating, as you can see by this list. Main stage entertainment will be by Jazz Daddy O's. Of course, we will have several of our own Villages resident lifestyle performance groups participating, like Sugar and Spice, the Cheerleaders, and the Mystic Jewels Dance Troupe. In conjunction with the festival is the Mardi Paw March, a Mardi Gras-themed pet march benefiting the Humane Society SPCA. The march is from 3.30 to 4 p.m. and ends with a best costume competition. Expect the competition to be tough. Now you must register your pet to participate. All the information on Mardi Gras and Mardi Paw can be found on the villagesentertainment.com website. The second festival in the villages is the Strawberry Festival at Brownwood Paddock Square on Saturday the 24th of February and Sunday the 25th of February. Saturday's hours are 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Sunday's 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. The Villages Festival offers ample opportunities to sample and savor the celebrated fruit with strawberry shortcake, strawberry milkshakes, chocolate dipped strawberries, strawberry popcorn, strawberry drinks, and many other treats. There will be flats of fresh strawberries from Plant City for sale. More on the significance of Plant City in a minute. There will be plenty of merchandise vendors on the square. Also, there will be games for the kids. The popular stilt walkers will be roaming through the crowd along with other entertainment, including bands on the main stage and villages performance groups. Our favorite entertainment at previous Strawberry Festival was the Paul Bunyan Lumberjack Show. Don't miss this one. Keeping with the strawberry theme and going outside the villages to Plant City, located south of I-4, just east of Tampa. Plant City claims to be the winter strawberry capital of the world, and there is no place that represents this claim better than Parksdale Farm Market. What began as a small farm market in 1969 has continued to grow and expand into one of the largest strawberry, citrus, and produce markets in Florida. Parksdale Farm Market is iconic in Central Florida in that it is a frequent stop for Florida governors and U.S. presidents. Former Florida Governors Jeb Bush and Rick Scott have visited, as well as U.S. Presidents George H.W. Bush and Barack Obama. Something special about Parksdale Farm Market is their offering of not only baked goods with strawberries, but also the food counter offering strawberry treats. My favorite is the fresh strawberries over ice cream, and Jennifer enjoys the strawberry shakes, which we admit is probably the best strawberry shake we've ever tasted. The seating area is shaded, and the tables are amongst the many varieties of plants for sale. We don't buy any plants when visiting, but we do pick up some additional produce, which is very good. They, of course, have fresh-picked strawberries for sale at a very reasonable price. Parksdale Farm Market is open year-round, and while they will not have those local picked strawberries for sale in the summer, they will have those strawberry milkshakes to enjoy. Visit in February, and you can enjoy both. Mount Dora will host its 11th annual Scottish Highland Festival from Friday, February 16th to Sunday the 18th. Wearing of the kilt is encouraged, but of course not required. There will be Highland game competitions for both men and women. There will be a gathering of the clans with lots of wares on display for purchase. There will be traditional food available, even haggis for the brave. Highland dancers, traditional bagpipe band, and some new wave music for entertainment. For more highlights of last year's festival, check out our video. For the details on this year's festival, check out the City of Mount Dora website. Well, that's our video on some of the festivals that are occurring in February. And hopefully you too get a chance to get out in Central Florida and have some strawberries. So until the next video, we wish you a great day. We'll see you then.